Welcome and this is the mood board section of the unit for GCSE ICT for designs. It's the last mark which is worth one mark. Now a mood board is something that when a customer goes to a company and asks them to design, to design a website, they want to fit it to a particular house style and ethos. So the mood board for the company that you're creating the website for will consider the colors of the background, the buttons, the fonts, the styles. They'll have a look at um, what you're going to include like animations, movies, anything that you want to include on it. So I've got an example below and you can see that it's got all the colors of a professional website which suits very much the arch uh, architectural firm that this website is for. It's got architectural kind of images in there and it talks about the header styles, the subheader styles, uh, alternate header styles and any other type of font. So some other examples. So if I click here you should be able to see how different mood boards are created for different purposes. All right, so we've got some nice adjectives. That's the focus of this particular website. They've given you some button styles, which is really, really nice. And this is an e-commerce mood board. So we've got all different colors and textures that they might include. It might include lots of icons and web icons. So that's a nice thing that you can put in. What web icons would be on your website? Is there a calendar kind of effect? Okay, so hopefully this will give you some ideas. So if you're doing, for example, a movie on your website then you could have a picture that links to a movie it could be a web uh, a video camera it could be a clapperboard if you're doing sounds you could put sound images you could put um, the audacity or the software that you're planning to use for your sound editing the same with if you've got animations on there you know what images symbolize animations so you're really reminding yourself what you are going to need to do and what house style that you are going to focus on when you're actually creating the website itself.